Around 2005, I had gone on a weekend break with three of my school friends. We were all 18 and had rented an apartment by the sea on the island of Gozo. It's a pretty common thing for locals to do. It's just enough separated to feel like a breath of fresh air without being a full-blown vacation. It was July, and summers here are very hot and very humid. Makes you feel proper disgusting sometimes. On the morning that we were supposed to catch the ferry back home, me and one of my friends woke up early and decided to go for a walk. We stopped by the sea in the village square. He left to go get a drink, and I just sat on a bench on the edge of the promenade in the square. About 20 minutes later, my friend still wasn't back, and I started looking around for him, still seated. Then I noticed this strange man crossing the square across the road from me. He seemed tall and well-kept, but the reason I call him strange is because he was wearing a Victorian-style suit. Coattails, black hat, and everything, even a bouquet of flowers in his hand. Again, this was summertime. Nobody in their right mind would even wear long pants, much less a formal get-up, to say nothing of the time period. Yet the few people around, even walking past him, acted like they didn't notice him at all. As he was crossing the road parallel where I was sitting, he turned to look at me, gave me a courteous nod with a hint of a smile, and walked around the corner. I looked around for my friend who still hadn't come back and felt compelled to look for this man. I crossed the road, turned the corner, and it's a dead end. No doors, nothing besides a derelict fishing boat as is normal for the area, and nothing else out of the ordinary other than it looked like this guy just disappeared into thin air. I walked back to the bench, sat down, and tried to make sense of what happened. My friend came back soon after, but I didn't bother bringing it up. I didn't feel any malice, dread, or anything from the man. All these years later, it still pops up in my head from time to time.